So every every Barraza main out there is just they're, they're always they're cheering Cody. right now. They're they're loving this. He's that guy. He's he is the, guy. the leader of the Wastelands. All right, Remy has chosen Blackguard Keep after Isidur and Cody Travis left three on the table for him to choose from. It all comes down to this. Whoever loses this takes third place. The winner moves on to grand final for their chance at the lion's share of $40,000. Oh, man. That is some serious moolah. That's a lot up. of pressure. Yeah, these, these games right now are worth thousands of dollars. It, you know, losing this is, is thousands of dollars missed out on. I mean, it's incredible how much money is at stake here in this Brawlhalla match. That's crazy. So Cody Isidru, Team Flashpoint rocking their standard double axes, just these big chunky swings. Yeah, they get a, they they make it look fast though. They got the moves. Oh, it's yeah. true. Hitting Cody Travis, knocks the weapons out of his hands. Cody Travis looking for a weapon. There's one, snags it immediately. And Remy off the side. Cody Travis might be able to finish him here. Oh, but he Faison. went for it. Phazon just anti-airing that blaster's recovery. Bounce him off the wall, going for the edge. <laughs> what? But Phazon able oh, to combo. Oh, okay. Cody Travis going to the other side. Phazon's chasing. That was crazy. Got the extra damage, but Isidru sent off the top. Cody Travis alone for a little bit. Remy going for these edge guards. Gravity cancel what? neutral light. Such a unique option. Yeah, and it worked because of how damaged he was. And there, but there goes Remy just as fast. Now Phazon, the only oh. person. Never mind. Everybody's down to their second stock. It's a super, super even game. I mean, you were saying you love to see the Barraza, and <laughs> Barraza. he gave it to you. This is a good one. This is gonna be this is this is gonna be a great match all throughout. All throughout. I mean, look at this. They're so evenly matched. It's we don't know who's gonna win. It's anybody's game. There's no upset here. It's just who who wins. Sidru, the one that's incredibly damaged here, though. Damage. Pretty even across the board, but is Sidru going to be the one that has to play that back support role? And Remy finding the Wise. Tommy Matt, sending him off the top corner. Team combo. Oh my gosh. Oh, he almost got it. He held on to that even signature though charge. He didn't finish it. It's that huge damage. So much damage. Yeah. And you really want that damage because Barraza's extra defense, I mean, it makes it so hard to knock him out. Isidru with the quick swap gets a big hit on the Phazon. A Phazon's in trouble. Ooh. Cody Travis, he's great at interrupting those combos, man. If something's going to hurt his friend, he's there to stop it. Man, look at the rotations. They got the perfect oh, sandwich Oh, again, Cody Travis saves Isager with a weapon throw, and they converted it into a double kill. Can you believe it? What a play. Absolutely Cody wild. Cody Travis, man. But still, Isidru needs to be careful. Deep Orange, I mean, he's been the one on the back foot this entire game, and it's been Cody Travis having to swoop in and keep his teammate alive. Isidru way off the side. This is dangerous for Isidru. He's on his final stock, and he's almost down. Remy and Faison are definitely looking for some of these oh. options now. They've got the power no, play against Isidru. Isidru. Oh, my goodness. He wow. got lucky. Faison used the wrong move to punish. Yep. And Isidru escapes. I mean, he was he would have been dead if, if uh, Faison used the side signature instead of a neutral signature. So, Isidru, count his lucky stars. Oh. And again, Cody Travis saving his teammate. How many times? Oh, never. Okay. Well... He All saved right. him enough times. Save him nine. <laughs> yeah, knock nine, him out nine. one. <laughs> I, I got to tell you, they, they've got to be thinking about that oh, one. Oh, man. Okay. Well, look, this is not, it's not over for Cody Travis here. Remy's at red. He's going, this platform's coming up. They can't keep doing this for long. It's the elevator. Your floor's up. You're getting <laughs> Your off. Your floor's up. Got to get off. <laughs> okay. Look how deep in the red Remy is. They might, ooh, nice combo. Remy's it's playing this right. Conversions. He's taking a support role here. Nice punish. Building up the damage on Cody Travis. Another oh, one no. for Faison. Cody Travis might be in trouble here. What a dodge. He dodged downward while off the stage. Pretty risky stuff, but he knows what he's doing. Oh, wow. Remy almost ready to catch him off that side air. Uh-oh. Single chop going for the double off the wall. Oh, he went for the neutral signature, but gets the weapon knocked out of his hands. Now with blasters, blasters, picks up Faison, gets the... Oh, man, that almost I KO'd. thought he'd get the KO. I thought so, too. Man, but oh now man. look, he's he got really both of them in that. red. What? Oh! oh, he recovered a little too early because the weapon was coming in hot from Remy way downtown. Scores the KO with a weapon a weapon throw. Remy and Faison win game one. Close game. Man, that was so back and forth. There's just such great plays all around. I mean, 
It's funny how Cody Travis saved Istadri so many times with <sighs> weapon throws and precise side airs. Only but to be the only cause to, of his downfall. Yeah, only to kill him at the wrong moment. That is unfortunate for them. But it was still extremely Three, close two, and one, still anybody's oh. match here. Faison and Remy up by one. And Thunderguard Stadium again. We've been seeing this pick a lot more often than usual. Remy Faison, you know they're going to be looking for those quick conversions for the team combos. That That's why I like this. Uh, it's a weird double stack. You get blue, red, blue, red. So that way somebody is sandwiched on each team. <laughs> yeah. Remy scored some good damage onto Cody Travis. Faison so far has taken the most damage out of anybody, and Nissa just pressing that even further. Off Ooh. the side now. And Faison's on arm Issa too. Oh. What an edge guard gets the KO on Faison. That was a pretty early KO too. That's going to serve Team Flashpoint very well. I mean, you just get to just strap on those Valkyrie wings and fly. <laughs> side air knocks Remy way off the stage. He's going to make it back unanswered. Faison alleviating the pressure oh for Remy, but oh no! God. That hit wasn't even intended for Remy. He ran into it. How unfortunate. I gotta tell you, that's just the coverage that Bryn has, and nobody's Bryn is better than Isidrus. All right, so now Team Flashpoint up by two stocks, and they've already applied some damage since taking stocks, so they have pressed their lead. This is really good. Oh no! Ooh. Cody Travis attacks the wrong direction and gets KO'd for it. The punish from Remy. Oh my gosh, and then Remy takes out his teammate. Oh man. Stocks are even, but there's still a decent damage lead for Team Flashpoint. Coach yeah, Travis. it is a pretty decent lead here for Team Flashpoint. Off the side, Isidru might just be able to finish oh, no. off Remy. Remy trying to recover. He got his jumps back. It's not over. He's going up the other side. Oh, clever. Smart play by Remy going up the other side there. He even kind of made it look like he was out of jumps. He, he jumped really late there. Yep. But look, he knows that Remy is unarmed. Cody Travis has been weapon starving, just clearing the field. Oh, the Cody with the double! And <laughs> Isidru giving the maniacal laughter, just being like, ah, <laughs> I had no part of that, but my teammate is godlike. My teammate is godlike. <laughs> oh, man. So what Remy and Faison, they've got to find some serious hits to bring this one back. Especially, oh my god, what? Remy getting Cody juggled Travis, off, and Issa so coming high. in to help, but Remy turns it around! Oh All right. man, Issa just got to be feeling the burn on that one. That's the craziness we need to see. That's what they have to find Yeah, he wasn't even that damage. It's just because Issa Drew went up trying to follow up so on Cody high. Travis's hit. He, I mean, he nearly got a KO, ends up getting KO'd himself with the Supreme Reversal by Remy. Ooh, slapped off the side. Now they've got momentary power play against the Isidru. Faison yep. threatening with signatures. And Is Isidru is the one left in the battle here with one stock, while Cody Travis still has two of his. We've been seeing Cody Travis deal with one, one, 2v1s a lot. Oh! Where he's the one. Oh, a nice one! And Faison might be going down. Yes! Another win! My gosh. Well, not right. another win. Uh, a win for Team Flashpoint. Now the set is one to one. Yeah, and I, I got to give huge credit to Cody Travis there extending his second stock. Yeah. I mean, he was he didn't so even lose it. incredibly damaged. And every time I thought he would get knocked out, it would be bouncing off the wall in the shenanigan zone. Or he would just kind of dip right around the attack. Yeah, and he was, and he was still out for blood. Like, he was dishing it out oh, despite yeah. being so near death. Absolutely what? phenomenal, but now we've got another map change, Shipwreck Falls. Yep, we're on, this is the, the Remy Faison classic here. They love this map. They're going to go to it whenever whenever they leave it open. Apparently, Cody, Travis, and Istra have no trouble uh, fighting on it, though. Yeah. They don't mind. They're, they're, they're leaving it open because they know they're going to pick it, and they don't mind fighting on it. Ooh, Cody, Travis just chunking big axe swings. Yeah, Remy taking a lot of damage off Cody Travis here at the start. He is the most damaged person here Whoa. in the match. Got to watch out for those signatures. Especially on a stage like this, Barraza has that neutral signature. Just leap up, grab you with the axe, fling you the opposite direction. So devastating. Man, oh man, tagging each other back and forth. Kale's are going to be coming out here. Oh, Isidru goes down. He bet the farm on that ground pound. That's unfortunate because they really, they had a damage lead with that. 
He was the least damaged person, and he lost his stock first. Very oh, unfortunate. Stocks are tied. Faison coming back. Cody Travis going for a crazy edge guard, but Faison just grabs the wall. He didn't have any trouble getting away from that one and knocks Cody Travis way off the side. Cody Travis now <laughs> back on the stage. And what just happened? He just kind of waved bye to Faison as they crossed each other <laughs> in the air. He's like, oh, I'm not in stun, but you are. See you next <laughs> <Bye>. stock. <laughs> Remy oh. evens up the stocks for his team, and because of the damage, they're actually in the lead here, but not by much. Ooh, finding the big ground pound hit. Covers so much area, so many different dodge reads. It's, look how damaged Isidru is. He's got to be He doesn't have a weapon either. He's looking for a weapon. Oh, man. Remy nearly gets a KO on him just for trying. Again. And ooh, what a read. Isidru with the gravity cancel neutral signature out of that string gets killed for it, though. Remy with the KO. He's always ready with that Tommy Matt. And they get the quick three-piece combo onto Cody Travis, and that's pushing into a serious edge guard. Uh oh, Faison's in trouble. Cody Travis oh, uppercuts man. him. It's not enough to KO. It's a little extra damage. Oh, yep, totally port. worth it. Nice play by Isidru. A little bit of friendly fire on his teammate, but he got the KO. I mean, you've got reduced force on your teammate, and also Cody Travis with that extra defense. He knew he would survive where Faison would not. Yeah, he made the right call. So now Cody Travis and Remy on opposite teams here, both extremely close to losing their stock. Man, Remy making great use of the bow recovery. Oh, no. And now Isidru has to fight alone, oh. not for long. Knock out Cody Travis alone against oh, three stocks. Oh, my goodness. Can he do this? It's going to be tough. He, he can get one good hit on Remy to knock him down to his final stock. He's still got to deal with the 2v1, though. Uh-oh. Not enough. Unarmed side air. Doesn't, and then doesn't you're going for okay, a well, ride. He got, him. he got him. He managed to take out that stock, but Cody Travis just took so much damage from Faison's gauntlets. Okay. Can Cody do this? King Cody. Big bite Cody. Fighting I mean, the big he's one ready to two. take a chomp, but it's... every time that he does, I mean, he gets tagged yeah. by whichever of the blue team is av available. Yeah, he's been here before. It's it's tough to deal with. These guys are so good at punishing these things. Look, Remy nearly oh got him for that. Oh, my gosh. What? Oh, man. Okay. Cody Travis on his last breath here. Whoa. And Remy gets him with the down air. I think that's it. Yep. Yep. Per beautiful. Oof. Clean, unarmed dive kicks. The classic edge guard. So Remy and Faison now winning two to one in the set. Just one more victory to go up to grand finals. And they can get that, that run back. Yeah, they get the run back against Ethan and Little Cats. Honestly, that was such a close match. They they deserve another shot at that. But it's a Drew and Cody Travis just as well. Yeah, it's I mean they are no strangers to grand finals. I mean, we've seen it time and again, they can even go the distance. Running it back to Thunderguard Stadium once again. Each team just grabbing their own spawn weapons. Yeah, no, 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 no robberies here. <laughs> <laughs> now everybody armed up. Cody, uh, Sindaru and Faison doing the spear neutralize back to back, <laughs> just past each other. So it's a choreographed dance. Oh, Cody tried to save Isidru from the string there, but fell just a little short with the recovery. Still managed to punish Faison. Got a, got a little hit on him for it. Didn't quite make up for all the damage, but it's better than nothing. Big axe swings about. Again, Cody Travis. He will not let Isidru get comboed. One hit's all you get when Cody's on your team. I got to tell you, if you want anybody to have your back, Cody is the best in the Co business. Yeah, Cody's got your back, man. He is He's a true bro. Ooh, just the scramble in the middle. Tons of damage. Everybody in the red. These first stocks should be, be lost here at any moment. It could go any way. You see Fa Faison trying to hang out in that center channel. He oh. was on arm, but caught out high. Oh, and just like that, both, both sides. Eye for an eye here. I mean, Cody anytime Travis. your teammate gets knocked out, you want to make sure that they at least pay for it evenly. Yeah. Get that trade. Oh, beautiful Ooh. down signature. It has that quick little step back. Oh, can Cody Travis survive from this? Isidru tried yes. to go down and help him, but Remy's preventing it. Cody Travis still able to make it back by himself. And, Cody uh, just sticking in unarmed. I mean, he's been in the thick of it. Oh, Faison with the uppercut on the corner, just catching Cody out. It's fairly even between these two. Yeah, very even. Cody Travis, of course, with the most health 
on the on the field. I mean, I mean, he's got the most defense, know. and he also just has such great movement. <laughs> he's, yeah, his survivability is absolutely insane, and I don't. I feel like it doesn't come at the cost of damage either. No, no. I mean, that's just probably due to him being one of the main marquee blasters players, mm -hmm. because you get used to having to play that ranged game and knowing that you have dead zones near yourself, so you have to rely on movement to not get hit. All right, now Isidru and Remy are very damaged each. They could oh. be seeing stocks lost any moment. And there goes Isidru, Team Flashpoint. Oh! Now having to make up for for damage lost. And Isidru, what? Oh, no. Okay. Well, I think he was going down anyway. Faison accidentally yeah. ground pounded his teammate. But Isidru was just right there. He was trying to enter. He tried to pull a Cody Travis, right? Yeah. Save his teammate <laughs> from finishing the combo. And uh, didn't quite work out. He killed his teammate instead. But he Not was, he was going is down Cody anyway. Travis. All right, damage. So look at the damage. Ooh. It's so, so even. But remember, uh, Remy and Faison just have to win one more, while Team Flashpoint have to win two here. Nice. All right, so slight stock advantage to Team Flashpoint. But Cody Travis has two. Isidru only has one, and he's in the orange. Could be huge for Team Flashpoint here. They got to win Big this to stay gauntlet. in the game, to stay in the tournament. I mean, if they lose this, they are out of the tournament. Ooh. Look at this. Now it's Isidru saving Cody Travis. That he got him back. Yeah, he owed him for that one. Isidru coming back up the right side. He's got to be careful because he is on his final stock. Doesn't want to leave Cody Travis in another 1v2. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you just hear <laughs> those axe swings. And oh, you know, yes. there goes Remy. Cody Travis and Isidru now with a huge advantage. Faison's on his final stock and very damaged. Looking like Team no. Flash. Oh no. He, he can make it back. He can make it back. He's fine. And Faison gets the nice KO. What? Oh. oh my. Do you believe in miracles? Can Faison somehow get this done? It's do or die. He has to do this right now for his team. Oh my gosh. He's, he's looking. You know he wants to get that run back in Grand Finals. It's this it. If he wins this, they're going to Grand Finals. He's got to play the stock of his life. The Gauntlets definitely have the damage potential to do it, but Cody has been so incredibly great with his movement. It's going to be tough to catch him out. That's it. All, All right, right, Cody Travis. We've earned a Game 5. Game 5. This is awesome. We, I love Game 5s. We're getting, we're getting them in spades here. I got to tell you, I mean, Cody and Isidru, like, do you expect anything other than a game five yeah, from right? them? Yeah. Oh, well, maybe a game ten. When we're right. In <laughs> oh, they always go the distance. Oh my goodness! Nice one by Cody Travis. You always count on King Cody to clutch it out for your team. Man, Banny, how much? Remy bans out all but three. And I'm just curious as to like how much potential damage has Cody prevented on a Sidru over yeah. the course of this set? Yeah, hundreds. I mean, my goodness. So often, it feels like he's done that seven times since we watched, since we started watching. You know, Isidru's got to be running around these matches feeling like he's got a bulletproof vest on because <laughs> he's like, "Yeah, I can overextend into stuff." Cody's yeah, got Cody's me. Cody's got me. <laughs> <laughs> he's a, he's a tank. Cody's the healer. You know, it's oh no my problem. Gosh. All right, we're going into game five now, and it's do or die for both of these teams. No second chances. Whoever wins this is going on to grand finals to face off against Ethan the Little Cat, the loser, out of the tournament in third place. This match alone is worth thousands of dollars. Man, that is a lot on the line, and you can see they are just fighting wow. for it. Wow, great synergy from Team Flashpoint here. Cody Travis and Nisadru making it look easy those quick rotations kind of leapfrogging over each other. Oh, oh, oh. it's a Drew's lucky to uh -oh, be alive. we got Team but Combo. What a, the, with the, the four seconds that they had with the power play, they scored two KOs. Beautiful play. It's Remy and Faison. power plays. They've got it again against Cody. Not able to get too much damage before Sidru can find his footing and stabilize the match. But man, man, that was what a great play. A crazy amount of damage. Just, I mean, even just the mental damage of getting caught out like that. Yeah, now they have to deal with this. Now they're on their back foot. They're fighting to stay alive instead of on the offensive. Cody Faison. trying over oh. this edge guard. Remy's incredibly damaged. He's definitely the oh, target no, here. Oh no, Isidru's in trouble. Oh. I don't think he can make it back. Oh no, another oh, stun. And double what? ground pound. Unbelievable. That is a two, four stock lead. 
for Remy and Faison, and it is looking all but over here. I mean, another oh uh, team gosh. combo. Remy and Faison, look at this. It just what? keeps going. Mr. Drew got deleted. It never ends. They Amazing. managed to tag Remy out, but you, it's way too late. It's five stocks to one Cody Travis. He's done Clutch Factor before. <laughs> yeah, but, but not like this. There's no way. I don't think anyone has pockets that deep. Oh, man. What a play. Faison and Remy. That was such a beautiful combo. All right. He's got one stock. Just needs four more. How quick is his math? <laughs> Remy Remy's just going dude, for he's, it. He's getting a little silly now that he's got such a big lead. He's gonna he's gonna make it look good. Cody sneaks up to the other side. Oh man, but you know what? Even with such a massive lead, you can't get silly against Cody Travis. Oh, the ground pound is all it takes. Remy cleaning up the edge guards. They just got their shot second yeah, shot. They earned the run back. Going back up to grand finals now to fight Ethan and Lil Capped once again. This is the winner's final we just watched right before this match we just finished watching. Man. And it all comes down to this.